As the new Formula One season is starting in Bahrain, we're on the brink of witnessing a dramatic shift that could end Red Bull's unchallenged dominance. Top teams like Mercedes, Ferrari, and McLaren have been tirelessly developing the innovative aerodynamic concepts, chassis redesigns, and strategic revamps that have the potential to turn the grid upside down. Over the years, F1 has seen numerous changes, each significantly impacting the sport's dynamics. From the introduction of turbocharged engines in the 1970s, which revolutionized car performance, to the hybrid era beginning in 2014, which focused on energy efficiency and technological advancement, each era has brought its unique challenges and developments. Notably, the introduction of the V6 turbo hybrid engines in 2014 marked a monumental shift emphasizing energy recovery and efficiency, while the 2019 aerodynamic changes aimed at improving overtaking showcased F1's commitment to more competitive racing. Fast forward to 2024 and the FIA is set to introduce a slew of rule changes that promise to redefine the F1 landscape yet again. The 2024 season is poised to be a turning point with comprehensive modifications that span various aspects of the sport. One of the most anticipated changes is in car design, particularly the aerodynamics. These changes are expected to not only improve lap times, but also promote tighter, more exciting on-track battles. Engine regulations are also undergoing significant revisions. The F1 power units are set to become more sustainable, with an increased focus on hybrid technology and a move towards more environmentally friendly fuels. This aligns with F1's broader goal of becoming carbon neutral by 2030. Additionally, the 2024 season will see alterations in racing formats, with adjustments to qualifying and potentially the introduction of more sprint races. Budget caps and financial regulations will also continue to evolve, aiming to level the playing field and ensure a more competitive and financially sustainable sport for all teams. The season is set against the backdrop of a record-breaking 24 race calendar starting on February 29th, with a strategic regionalization of races for enhanced sustainability, including the return of the Chinese Grand Prix and the rescheduling of the Japanese Grand Prix to September. Notably, the sprint race format is undergoing improvements, though details are yet to be finalized, with six sprint races planned in China, Miami, Austria, Austin, Brazil, and Qatar. These adjustments aim to inject more excitement and variability into the race weekends. On the technical front, the FIA's regulations for 2024 include significant modifications, particularly in car design and aerodynamics. The aerodynamic rules continue evolving from the groundbreaking changes introduced in 2022, focusing on reducing turbulence and enhancing overtaking opportunities. One notable introduction is the cooling scoop, a response to the extreme heat conditions like those experienced during the 2023 Qatar GP aimed at improving driver comfort and safety. At the floor level of the car, minor changes are implemented to enhance driver safety, involving the removal and lightening of some metal parts from specific areas of the monoplane. Engine and power unit modifications align with Formula One's sustainability goals, setting the stage for a transition to more eco-friendly fuels and emphasizing biofuels. This change is expected to influence engine designs and performance dynamics significantly. Teams are likely to explore new strategies within this framework, especially considering the major changes anticipated in 2026. Another significant change is the reduction in the window for teams to lodge appeals against decisions. Previously, teams had 14 days to appeal, but now they must do so within four days or 96 hours, with the possibility of a 24-hour extension in special circumstances. Additionally, teams will now have to pay a deposit for appeals, which will be refunded only if they are successful or if the FIA deems it fair in the event of a failed petition. Another major change is the increase in potential fines for breaking the rules. The maximum fine that stewards can impose has been quadrupled to 1 million pounds, with other categories also seeing increases. This move aims to ensure stricter compliance with the regulations and could lead to some costly penalties for teams and drivers. The F1 Sprint format is also undergoing a tweak in 2024. Sprint qualifying will move from Saturday to Friday, following an initial free practice session. The 100-kilometer sprint will then take place on Saturday, ahead of the Grand Prix qualifying later that day, with the Grand Prix itself remaining on Sunday. 
This adjustment is expected to make the sprint weekends more engaging. Furthermore, teams will now have greater flexibility during their promotional events. They can now cover double the distance, up to 200 kilometers, during their two official filming days. This change allows for more comprehensive car shakedowns and capturing more footage. Changes are also being made to the testing of old cars. Teams can now run cars that are at least two years old as part of their testing program, but all components used must have been run at least once in an official testing session or race weekend. This measure is designed to prevent teams from testing new items on older cars that could then be used on the current car. The introduction of the cost cap has been a game changer in leveling the playing field. In 2024, teams will have increased limits on capital expenditure over a four-year period, allowing them to upgrade their facilities. This change is particularly beneficial for teams that have finished in the bottom four of the standings on average since 2020, with the limit raised from $45 million to $65 million. These rule changes for the 2024 season are poised to add new dimensions to the competition, ensuring closer compliance with regulations, enhancing the sprint format, and providing teams with more opportunities for development and promotion. Teams and experts' reactions to these changes are diverse. While the sustainability drive and potential for closer competition are widely welcome, concerns have been raised about adapting to new elements like the cooling scoop and the sprint race format. Experts anticipate a tighter race for the championship challenging the dominance of top teams like Red Bull. There's a general consensus that the 2024 season will be a pivotal year, laying the groundwork for the significant overhauls expected in 2026. With all 20 drivers returning for 2024, the stability in driver lineup across teams set the stage for a highly competitive season, as teams like Mercedes, Ferrari, and McLaren aim to disrupt Red Bull's stronghold and reposition themselves at the forefront of the championship. As the 2024 Formula One season draws near, fans worldwide are buzzing with anticipation and a hint of skepticism. The excitement is palpable for the record 24 race calendar, especially with the return of the Chinese Grand Prix. However, questions and cautious optimism linger around the new sprint race format, leaving fans eagerly awaiting more details. Yet, amid these anticipations, challenges loom on the horizon. Teams are grappling with adapting to these new regulations while navigating the constraints of the cost cap, now with a substantially increased maximum fine for penalties. The changes in the review process, including a fee for contesting decisions, could stir controversies in contentious race situations, adding a layer of complexity to decision-making. Safety remains a prime focus, with teams and drivers adapting to new measures aimed at enhancing performance under challenging weather conditions. In their pursuit of glory, teams face the strategic puzzle of balancing innovation with regulation compliance, a dance that could level the playing field and intensify the competition. Red Bull team principal Christian Horner has voiced expectations of heightened rivalry due to the largely unchanged technical regulations. As the season progresses, the gaze of the F1 world will inevitably shift towards the significant changes anticipated in 2026 with teams already in the throes of planning and simulations, even though physical production of the new cars is set for a later date. This mix of continuity and change promises not only a showcase of intense competition and strategic mastery, but also a step forward in F1's relentless march towards a more sustainable and technologically advanced future.